Hi everyone, this is Cyber here. I'm here today to bring you a review for Jetpack Vacation. I did play tour, uh, when there was a beta. Um, the full release dropped today, and I wanted to show you a little bit of gameplay and just talk about what I feel about the game. So without further ado, let's get into it. Um, I don't know if it'll show up. I don't remember because I never actually recorded this. Um, nope, I have to switch over. Right. Should be popping up any second. Okay. So you have rockets on your hand. It tells you how much the these coins you have. Um, you gotta squeeze both both triggers. All right, you gotta do the tour. Hey, tourist. I'm right. Steve from Tourism Infinity, and I'll be your guide for today. Let's get you started. Squeeze the triggers on your jetpacks to propel yourself forward. <laughs> That's it. Now, head down the gangway. All right, so these top triggers for Oculus is right here. It's not the bottom ones. The bottom ones don't do anything. So it's this one. And you control up and down. And you just gotta hold them frontwards and- Welcome to Jetpack Vacation. Make your way to the Welcome Center and I'll talk a little bit more about what we have on offer. So Jetpack Vacation, this is the island. Um, you have coins and stuff you collect. Let's run up here to the stage and it'll tell us. Hey, you made it. Hey, I have a surprise for you. Look at the screen. Ta-da, it's you. See that stylish suit you're wearing? That's your vacation suit. It keeps you protected while zooming around with your jetpacks. Okay, enough of that. Let's talk excursions. At Jetpack Vacation, we have a bunch of exciting excursions to choose from. You can access each of these excursions by flying through our excursion portals, which can be found by exploring the island. So, go on, explore! That's it from me for now. Happy vacationing. Okay. All right, so that's pretty much it of the intro. Um, we got Target Patch, you got Jetpack Stadium. Um, there might, we might actually find some people today because it is a release day. Have a vacationing. Um, there are stuff you could collect, like coins and stuff. But well, let's just start flying around. See, there's coins up there. We could get a boost here. Nice! You found a boost. Hold the boost button to travel even faster. Right. The boost. <laughs> what a rush! This is a dance stage. All you can do is really this. You can't move your body or anything. All right, so let's go up at the top of the volcano. I'll just show you guys around a little bit. And then I'll talk about my feelings about the game since I have played kind of much. So they have changed a little bit from this in this build, I will say. So the last build I play. Cool, you found a coin. So I already have one for Just had a few coins. It made sound now. I'm just gonna collect the ones up here. And show you the lava doesn't do anything, I don't think. You just swim in it pretty much. Oh no, it does oh, yeah. toasty. Okay, so they did so they do they did add where that volcano actually hurts you. Okay. So yeah. Oh, there's someone over there. There's actually someone playing. Let's go let's say hello, let's say what their thoughts on the game is. Hello! Heart... Hartman? I guess. I don't know if he can actually hear me. Hello? Oh! Looks like you found an experimental excursion. This uh. one's not quite finished yet, so it might be a little rough around the edges. Well, <laughs> you can still try it out, though. Oh, racing. They added racing. That's one thing I said about uh, they needed to add. Um... 
so you pretty much just fly around collect coins in this world um, I don't think there's anything else hidden in here unless they added stuff oh there's a waterfall Did you drown let's see if they added this yep nope you do drown Ooh, all right, so they have added stuff in this build. I'm super glad about that. You can actually... There you go. Whoa, I bumped. All right. So you got this down here. This is the target practice. So... over are now the... approaching the portal to target practice. So, in this excursion, you can fly around famous landmarks. If I go there, targets, I'll show you. Balls. If you'd like to try this excursion, fly through the portal. So you can see all the worlds, all the places, and like over there's the Target, there's the the soccer. But the, you don't, you can't fly all the way over there. But you can Welcome go in here. Welcome to the vacation suits shop. So here, I can buy can one of these shiny new vacation suits. Fly through a ring to try one on. Go on, treat yourself. See, I can try it on, but I'm gonna actually gonna try to save my coins and get the green one since that's the only one right here. I'm not a big fan of the watermelon one. I want the pineapple one. Because I have zero, but I actually have a 52. So it's, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what's going on. There's some issues they have to fix. Um, but let's try the target practice first. Wait, what's that? I want to see what that is. That's new. There's not new signs and stuff. Hold to oh. So you can hover somewhat if you ask you to tap it, it'll work. You can hover. Oh, I messed up. I went in the water. Ooh, refreshing. Alright, first things first, let's actually go to soccer since that's over here. They're actually going faster with the rockets. Hey, you're now approaching the Jetpack Stadium. Alright, Jetpack Stadium. We'll see if anybody's here. Anybody's playing soccer. I will say it's pretty hard to actually score unless they adjust it a little bit. I don't know. I wish you could grab them. All right, let's see if anybody's here and see. All right, let's go. Welcome to Jetpack Stadium. Fly through either the orange or blue tunnel to join a team. To start a match, you'll need other tourists. If no one's here, try inviting a friend. I think it's the same. Yep, same ones. Oh, let's see if it. No. Excuse me. Um, it shows how many inch. Each person, I guess, scored, or oh, uh, yeah, how much each person has scored? So they added other stuff in here, I guess. Wait, I'm turning around. That's another sign, guys. They added noise to these, I guess. I don't know what these guys are. I guess they're ones that make them bounce around. Oh, it's gonna score on us. Maybe not. So you actually need players to do this? As you see, it, they're... No, at the moment there's no one playing and these people are not helping Because I'm actually trying to catch the ball I'm gonna wait till it bounces back Don't touch it you all right, you know what? We're out. <laughs> All right, so that was the soccer, pretty much. 
If that person would have touched it, there's a dance floor over there again. Um, pretty much it. Alright, let's go through again. Go back to the main island. Hello? Can you hear me? Hello? Alright, just he's ignoring me, just looking around, okay? I don't know if I actually have the mic on. I should actually check that. I'll have to check when I go. Well, let me, I'll check it for you guys. So this is the target practice. I don't know. I'll check it afterwards. It's not a big thing. I know it's recording on my gameplay. So Welcome to Landmark Island. Your one-stop shop for all your sightseeing needs. Shoot the target up ahead to start our target practice mini game. Or feel free to fly around and explore. Alright, so your face is fly around and shoot. Okay, so it loads you in. Everything. Here we go! Fly around and shoot as many targets as possible in 60 seconds. Yeah, I don't know how good I'm gonna do it, guys, but and I'll try. And go! I'm trying, guys. I think I did okay. Awesome work! You did great. So, do they have a record thing? I don't know. I wish there was a scoreboard for it, but I think I did okay. Two hundred is not too bad. I got all the ones over, pretty much over here. I got a good amount there. I think there was more up there, but. Uh, I don't want to try too hard. Uh, let's see what's down this tunnel. I never, this is like different. They changed it a little bit on this build. I don't think there's anything over here. I really don't. All right, guys. See, I don't like the camera following me. I don't like it. That's one thing I had an issue with. But the camera should always show up when you're doing that dancing. <laughs> Alright, let's go back. And I think we have... Uh, one more. Which is the new thing. Which is over here. Now. Yeah, I don't think there's anything else yet. Alright, let's try this. Excuse me. Oh, just want to make sure I'm turning the right direction. Oh, so yeah, this is very early on, you can tell. So, so we're just gonna do a time thing. Cause, uh, all right, let's go. Let's actually go, try to go down. Eh. Eh. 
Don't hit me, don't hit me. Ah! Yeah. Oh shit. That thing's moving fast. Trying to catch up to it. There we go. Okay. Ugh. Okay. Go, go. This is gonna be the problem. Okay. Gosh dang it. You really bounce off of them. <clears throat> Alright, now you gotta run around the buildings. I'm going up high. It looks like they use a lot of the same assets here. Which is, f I guess, is fine. Because it's still early on. And I hope they put in, like, new, um... Oh boy. Uh, it looks like they want to put in some stuff you they'll shoot. Which is fine, that's fine. How long is this thing? Okay. Ah. If you take it slow, it's not too bad. Like, I'm tapping. Oh, shit. I'm trying not to get hit. Ow. Are you mother trucker? And we're done. Into the race. No timer or anything? Okay. Alright, we're in this. Alright. Didn't tell me time or anything, but okay. Alright, let's go back to the main area and see. As I'm collecting coins, I'll talk about the game, talk about my feelings about it. All right, guys, so what do I think of this game? All right, right now, I think it's $6.69, which is a weird number, but um, I, for that price, it's not too bad because they're going to put edge stuff to it. So I would get it right now if you're going to play this game at all. I say it's kind of worth getting it at that price because they're gonna add stuff because it is kind of early access but we don't know how much stuff they're gonna add on at all I will say they are pretty cool because I did I got a, a free key for this I didn't have to pay for it um, but just added wish list and stuff of course it's over now but I'm not Persuaded or anything to give them a better score or anything. Um, I would not buy it for the original price. I would highly recommend not, not. So if you can get it while it's on sale and you get someone interested in this game, then I would say pick it up while it's on sale. Um, I would say more like they need to add a lot more stuff to do with your friends and stuff. Or do with people because right now there's not much to do in the game at all alone or with people right now I'm just collecting coins trying to just get what I can like see this is about what you can do pretty much it's just collect coins because you can't play with anyone or anything they took the ring out here. There was a ring. You just fly for it's over there. All right, let's see if I can fly for this. Um, the controls work good. I don't have any too much issue. Um, 
they do get take a little bit of getting used to. Uh, I think coins do respawn because I thought I got these before already. Um, sounds fine. Everything like it it works. It's just there's not much to do in here and personally I'm not trying to be rude to the devs at all I know it's not easy making a game and stuff But personally, I, I really think they could have just made a VR world I know they probably want to try to make a little bit of money off it or actually Build some if they want to go and make other games and stuff they can um, um So yeah My thoughts oh, of the game, like if I'm gonna put a rating on this, um, I would say like a four. Everything is really basic. There's nothing like amazing graphics or anything like that. Oh, that's it! Look up at the big screen. You're wearing a new vacation suit. <laughs> wow. Now that's fashion. If you have enough coins, exit the shop to make your purchase. Okay. So. Nice. Now there. you can fly around with style. All right, I'm in style. Woo. Okay. All right, guys. That that is the base of the game. You see the whole game pretty much. There's not much to do here, besides feel like Iron Man. Like I wish I. I wish it was a little backwards, like you could go like this, and when you want to break, you go like that, like reverse controls, kind of. So you kind of feel like Iron Man a little bit. Instead of going like this, that takes you down, this takes you up. But, I hope you guys enjoyed this short review. Um, make sure you leave a like if you did. Tell me your thoughts of the game. Do you think it's worth the six dollars and sixty nine cents, or do you think it's worth the original price? Some people think it is. I just I hold my money at higher standards. Um, if I did not get the the key the way I did, I probably wouldn't have played it. But I said, hey, they gave me a key. At least I'll make a review for it, and yeah. And make let other people know and stuff. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video, like I said, and make sure you leave a like and I'll see everyone in the next video. Peace. Attention viewer, if you enjoyed that video, please leave a like, comment, subscribe.